stops Even when it all looks different Even if I grow up Even if something's missing If something's missing I'm still coming home I'm still coming home So sweet and knows all my strength, knows all my weakness. Reminding me that I was a child, reminding me that I I'm coming home. I am coming home. in his arms and now she's older a little bolder she's still resting on his shoulders so that she doesn't miss a thing way above the crowd she sits and sings that i'm coming home he is coming home Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. My name is Courtney Jo. If you are new here, welcome. If you've been here before, welcome back. Today, I don't really have a plan for what this video is going to be, but I thought it would just be fun to maybe film something this morning. Um, it's a Saturday. It's about 7 a.m. Belle, oh, Belle, Belle. She literally just walked through Kita's pee. Hmm, yum. But it's about 7 7 15 um i was up at like 6 45 i think because i've been up really early for work this week so i just thought i'd get up um bell wasn't awake yet but like she's ready to be awake she's been in the kennel for like nine hours so brought the girls out here thought we'd play a bit and again probably just show you what i do on a weekend morning before everyone's awake because normally everyone else doesn't wake up till like 9 30 so i just hang out with the dogs and I love it. So I'll show you guys what I do in the morning. So for proper introductions, this is Kita, my sister's dog. She is a Sheltie, but black and white. And then Belle Girl, back there who you guys have met. Belle is 11 weeks old today, and on Monday we'll have had her for two weeks. Um, she's been I know people always say it like I have the best dog ever but she seriously has been such a good dog I think it helps having Kita around for her to like follow but she like sleeps through the whole night um we're home so we can take her out plenty so peeing and like going to the bathroom inside hasn't been a huge problem but obviously she's a puppy so she's done it before but yeah it's definitely been a help having another dog but look at how cute she is Good morning, honey. Good morning. Huh? Oh, you need some scratches this morning? Oh, yeah. <laughs> Did you have a good sleep? Did you have a good sleep, honey? Oh, my sweet girl. Huh? Do you guys want to play? <gasps> you guys want to play? <laughs> She's so cute, just waiting to see if Kita wants to play. Belle's always in the mood to play Kita. Normally Belle has to get Kita riled up and they'll like zoom me around the whole yard. It's the cutest thing. What do you think? Oh, you are so cute. You are so cute, huh? You're all wet. Have you been rolling around out here?
Good girl. Come on, Kita. Kita, come on. No? Good job. Don't bite me. You didn't even eat your food from yesterday. Look, Belle. What's this? She didn't even eat yesterday's food, so I'll probably put a little more.
that's not yours. Look, yours is right there. Hey, no. No. This is yours. No. No. So we struggle a bit with eating. Excuse me. What? Look, play with a toy or something. Look at this. Look at this. Look at this. Look at this. Get it. Get it. Okay, so like I was saying, we struggle a bit with eating around here because Belle likes to eat Kita's food. Why is this not focused? Um, Belle likes Kita's food, which technically it's the same brand, but Belle is on the puppy food. So the other problem is Kita only likes to eat her food off the ground, like off of her tray thing. So Kita's food normally has to wait until Belle has already eaten or we put them like in separate areas. It's not like it's a big problem, like Belle won't eat her whole sitting, but she'll eat enough kibble and she just needs to learn that it's not hers. So yeah, normally Kita has to wait until Belle's done to eat or Belle is sleeping, which will obviously change once they eat the same food. It won't be as big of a deal. We'll just obviously have to make sure her, like Belle's not eating more than Kita, because Kita is not food driven, right, girl? She just eats when she wants to. She's not like begging to eat. But same thing for Belle. She's not really food driven. Like she doesn't get super excited to eat. But she didn't eat all of her food last night. Just she was starving this morning, which is why she ate so much. But yeah, that's the food chronicles with two doggies, huh? Sweet girl. But yeah, now I just hang with them really. It's kind of fun. They'll basically play with each other all day long if we let them, so when they get going, as long as they're not being mean or anything, I just let them play. To breathe the air, they taste so sweet in. Knows all my strength, knows all my weakness. Reminding me that I was a child, reminding me that I, I'm coming home. I am coming home I want to lay on these old streets I want to stay here for a while I want to go to where we used to I want to do the things that we used to do Cause I'm coming home Cause you are my home 
very sweet when they play. They play like they're actually sisters and they really do love each other. Oh. <laughs> she always just falls to her back and puts her paws up. But they do care for each other. The other thing we don't know is like if it's weird or not. Belle will like go underneath Kita as if she's gonna like nurse. And Kita just stands there and like accepts it. So I don't know if that's her like taking over like the mom figure. But we always stop it because we think it's weird. And I don't know if there's any dog experts watching this. Comment down below if that's a normal thing. They're both girls. Kita is spayed or neutered, whatever it's called for females. And Belle is not. She's obviously only 11 weeks old. And it doesn't happen every day. It just happens on occasion. But... Yeah, it's so funny. We're all like, what the heck is going on? My brother was here last night and he's like, is she trying to nurse? I was like, oh my god, stop. So yeah, let me know if that's normal or not. Oh, hi. Do you want to play with the rope? She got me this to play with. Oh, hi. She's still resting on his shoulders so that she doesn't miss a thing. Way above the crowd, she sits and sings that I'm coming home. He is coming home. I want to lay on these old streets. I want to stay here for a while. I want to go to where <laughs> they'll actually also play tug of war together, which is so cute. As you can see. She takes on the big rope and she takes on the little puppy rope. Makes sense, doesn't it? my phone because I didn't bring my real camera out here but we're out for P number two normally when they play for a long time which we were just playing for like 30 45 minutes I just know we need to go outside otherwise Belle will have an accident so we just take her out basically like anytime after she eats or that they play for quite a while just to like let her know you know like when you start feeling the feelings we're supposed to go outside so it looks like Kita's taking a dump <laughs> Belle's exploring on the wood chips and yeah they'll probably play for a little bit longer out here honestly and then Belle's probably gonna nap because that's what she does is she plays sleeps eats poops and does it all over again and then Kita will be able to eat breakfast so that's what we're doing and then I'm gonna make coffee because I'm freaking tired <laughs> Oh, yeah, Kita's pooping. Oh, and Belle is pooping again as well. Look at that. You go, girls. Successful outdoor trip. We have two dogs going number two, which is always good news. Um, it's funny, my sister and I, we were watching them last night play, and my sister's dog is so much like her, just like chill, 
like we'll play if you want to play but like it's not gonna force you to play and I mean Belle's still a puppy so we don't know what her like adult personality is like but I definitely see myself in her so it's just funny that they are like playing together now like Belle's super fearless and like we'll jump off the couch and play very aggressively with Belle and that's totally something I would have done oh she's gonna try and get under the fence Belle Belle hey she literally just had her head through there. Hey, we don't go in there. Come on, let's stay on the grass. And it begins. Oh, they'll follow me over here. No, let's go out there. Go to the grass. Yes, there we go. Okay. <laughs> oh my goodness. They're both herding dogs, so they both want to herd each other. But one always ends up hurting the other. Herding, I guess I should clarify. H-E-R-D-I-N-G, not H-U-R-T-I-N-G. Come on, who's gonna go? Girls, not down there. This way. There we go. <laughs> oh my god. Belle, come here. This way. Over here. Belle, come here. And Belle's hiding spot is under the barbecue. Come on, Belle. Come on. Come on, Belle. Belle. Hey, come on. Come on. Belle, Belle come on. Get out of there. Belle, come on, come on, come on. Come on, come on, get out of there. Oh my goodness. Okay, I think playtime's done, everyone. Shadows of the morning are crawling on my floor When I just want to lie here, nothing less, nothing more There's raindrops on my window and I'm going nowhere fast Behind these closed eyes I visualize what will come and what is past But Mama turn the light on, Mama stir me from my sleep 
been sleeping too long. I've been dreaming too long. And I just wanna lie here, but I don't wanna die here. So I'm gonna take my best shot. Shot out of bed into the tip top. Sitting on the edge of my bed. Waiting by the river, waiting by the river. I found a little piece of homestead. Sleep. 